Yemen's Houthi rebels terminated a ballistic rocket towards the official living arrangement of Saudi King Salman in the kingdom's capital Riyadh on Tuesday. This was the second rocket assault in two months and as per Al Masyar TV today's strike was countering for the administration's assaults that killed more than 130 Yemeni regular people since December 6. Saudi authorities however guaranteed the rocket had been gone for local locations and had been captured with no losses. Press TV reports, Mohammed Abdul Salam, a healthy representative, said the Birkin, Volcano, H-2 rocket, which has a scope of 800 kilometers, was let go toward al Yamama Palace in the western rural areas of the capital where the ruler gets going to remote dignitaries and best Saudi authorities. Yemen's al Masira TV channel, referring to military sources, said the rocket focused on a huge social affair of Saudi pioneers without giving further subtle elements. The Saudi drove coalition focusing on Yemen, notwithstanding, asserted that the rocket had been caught in southern Riyadh. Ballistic rocket captured over Riyadh, the coalition said in an announcement. Saudi media guaranteed that, that there have been no reports of harm up until now. Reuters columnists, nonetheless, say they have heard an impact and seen a tuft of smoke transcending the Saudi capital. An AFP reporter likewise heard a boisterous blast at 1,050 GMT right away before the planned revealing of the Saudi spending plan, which is generally declared from Yamama Palace by the Lord. Al Alam News Arrange referred to educated Yemeni sources as saying that the blast occurred 1.5 kilometers far from the U.S. international safe haven in Riyadh. Agent representative of the Yemeni armed force cautioned that after the Saudi drove coalition focused on the nation's presidential royal residence in the capital city of Sana'a on December 5, none of the Saudi castles would be protected. The rocket unit of Yemen's defense ministry likewise said that the rocket assault focused on the meeting of Saudi authorities at Al Yamama Palace including that all the Saudi royal residences and the kingdom's military and oil offices are totally inside the scope of Yemeni rockets. It was the second Houthi rocket assault against Riyadh in the course of recent months. The primary assault focused on Riyadh Global Airplane Terminal on November 4, however Riyadh asserted that it figured out how to catch the shot. In opposition to the claim by the Saudi military, a report by the New York Times proposed that the ballistic rocket was really not caught. The second rocket assault on Riyadh went ahead that day that the UN Human Rights Office checked the killings of 136 Yemeni regular people and other non-soldiers in the Saudi drove airstrikes more than 11 days. The UN Human Rights Office representative, Rupert Colville, said the losses happened between December 6 to 16 out of four northern regions focusing on that UN authorities are profoundly worried over the rising number of regular citizen setbacks in the ruined nation.